Welcome back everyone to Priya's Satvik Kitchen. Today we are making mango chutney. So I have washed and peeled a green mango and then I have grated it on here so you can so this is how it looks all grated. And then we will use salt I have salt there sugar and this is the pickle mix you can get it at any grocery store I have some mustard oil here mustard seed I have curry leaf that I have finely chopped and one red chili this is optional you can if you want it spicy you can always add this or you can skip it so in a pot we will put Two teaspoon of the pickle mix which has cumin in there, mustard, ajwain and fennel crick. So we'll just roast it on low heat for about a minute. After it's fully roasted, we'll put it in a coffee grinder and grind it. So in a low heat, you can roast it for a minute. And then we'll start with the recipe. Okay, so now we'll put all the ingredients together. So we have a pot here. It's on medium flame. We will add two teaspoon or maybe three teaspoon of mustard oil. You can use two or three according to how much oil you want to use in your cooking. And we will put half a teaspoon of mustard oil. Let it warm up a little bit so the flavors come out. And then we'll add the curry leaf and the chili in there. There you go. Let's heat it up till the flavor comes out, and then we'll add all the mango in there. Half a teaspoon of salt. Salt depends on your taste, how much salt you want in your food. So you can always cut down on that a little bit. If you want, you can add more or less according to your taste. And then, depending on which kind of mango you are using if it's too sour you can add one big teaspoon of sugar i'm just using half a teaspoon here mix everything together And then I have the pickle powdered powder here that we roasted and grinded in the coffee grinder. So we will put two teaspoons of that. Mix everything together. And 
and if you want that yellow color you can put a little bit of turmeric powder in there to bring out the yellow color but that's optional as well okay so we'll add a little bit of turmeric powder in here just to bring that yellow color out and as I said, this is optional. If you want, you can. If you don't have turmeric powder, you can skip that step. And there you go. It's all done. Nice and easy and really tasty. Okay, enjoy the mango chutney and do try and let us know how it turned out. You can also put a comment on this video saying how's your turned out and if it didn't turn out, let me know so I can help you uh, with the ingredients to make it lesser or more. Enjoy and subscribe. Thank you.